Hello, hello. Welcome to Food Talk TV. This is Grub Match. So we're getting ready to get started tonight. We have an ingredient of cereal and we're going to be waiting for Chef Nella Bacci to come on in one second here. All right. So this is, you are watching the only live cooking competition show on TikTok and you get to vote the audience. So as soon as we are done cooking, you can go to our website at foodtalktv.com or grubmatch.tv and, and vote for your choice. So you did a good job tonight. Hello, hello. Hi. Can you hear me? Oh, yes, I can. Bear with me one second. Hi, sweetheart. I'm trying to turn the camera. There we go. Okay, okay. <laughs> Thank you. All right. We're going to be waiting for Miss Sherry Skinner to come in as well. And Hi, Miss Sherry. Oh, there we are. That was so quick. Okay, there's Sherry. Ah, yes. Hi, Sherry. Hello. Hi, there guys. We go. It's not my, my camera is not wanting to work. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. Okay. Now we go. Okay. So, um, I, we have a few orders of business to take care of. Kind of letting to see if any. If more people are going to come in, please, guys that are here, please share the live with your friends and um, tell them to come on in here and watch this. These two are going to be battling it out using the secret ingredient, which is what, girls? Cereal. Breakfast cereal, sweet and savory. So they've got some things to do. And uh, they're going to be cooking for one hour. And I don't have the fancy timer. I've got this old school timer. But it keeps time. Did you know that? Okay, so I need Miss Chef Nella Bacci. I need you to, am I saying your name right? <laughs> it's Nella Bacci. Nella Bacci. Okay, well, I said yes. Nella Bacci. Okay, well, I, yes. I'm saying it Arkansas style. But okay, so I need to know about you. Tell us about you. Well, I have been a chef since I can remember, like I said, and uh, this is my passion. I my specialty is Italian food, but I love cooking from around the world, and I have applied those cultures into all of my cooking and bring all of those amazing flavors not only to my loved ones, but also to my clients and to everyone that watches me and that I have the pleasure to provide cooking and baking classes to them. So today I'm bringing a little bit of everything with all cereals and I cannot wait for this to, to start and for you all to enjoy. <laughs> okay, so when I come back in, I'm going to want you to tell me what it is you're currently working on. Okay? Perfect, of course. Perfect, uh, yes. Well, well, so here's a good time to tell you that um, last competition uh, thank you for being so gracious and waiting a week while our sketchy got better that was very kind of you to be so gracious but uh, we didn't get to have grub match last week guys and the last competition was sketchy and just like granny and uh, yeah. so just uh, so sketchy shelf won that competition and she's currently undefeated so it's time for you to try your best to bring her down bring her down hey, you I'm know here. she's my bestie I'm and i only have the I'm love. My gun. Okay, okay. so sketchy you have anything you need to tell us i don't think so you want to tell us Perfect. what you're cooking or um well i'm i'm uh yeah i guess you want to or do you want to wait until we come back yeah. And you say, yeah i'll wait till you come back and pop in okay okay right. well i'm gonna let y'all see me hit the start button are y'all ready perfect okay, okay. Yes. let's go thank you you have okay. one hour i'll see you then okay perfect see you all right i gotta figure out how to get out of here all right Welcome, welcome, everybody. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to start with this. I'm sorry. I am 
some chocolate butter, Reese's cinnamon rolls. Oh, that's delicious. I'm starting with my mac and cheese. Ooh, okay. Oh, yes. Do, 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 do. How many minutes? How many? It's already 10 minutes. What we do with this stuff now? I had so much bad luck with these with these sheets in the past. I think I took my. I'm already getting. And you're doing cinnamon rolls here, sir? What was that? You're doing cinnamon rolls. What? Cinnamon rolls. What? Cinnamon rolls. Oh, yeah. Cinnamon rolls. Yes, yes, cinnamon rolls. Cinnamon rolls. Love that. <laughs> These are chocolate butter. So, I've got in here some brown sugar, peanut butter, butter, cinnamon. Okay. I got the pasta board, guys, and making the delicious room for that mac and cheese. Oh, it smells amazing. Really good. my up here. So this is gonna have chocolate chips inside. And believe it or not, cereal. And this is actually a thing. Oh beautiful this is thickening up. That's what I wanted. Okay. Beautiful. I'm more just gonna add a little bit of more milk for this. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing twice. Same thing twice. Hey guys, I'm adding the three blend cheese. I already previously shredded this. And we have pepper jack, mozzarella, and the other one is coffee cheese. Oh, Look at that, guys. Right. Oh. I'll tell you what, my kids are going to be eating all this stuff later on. <laughs> like here, <laughs> I got everybody on board. Tell me, yeah, I Away. Oh, uh, next, 
waiting for that. Really quick buttermilk yes. marinade. And it's going to be shrimps. So I am Rick's buttermilk marinade for my what? No, I'm just gonna sweeten the milk. I need to sweeten up for my so tricks. Okay, silly rabbit tricks are for kids. I've got my... <laughs> that is awesome. Okay, I'm doing now some for Fino. Then I'm going to pop from delicious cheese. Where's this little Okay. It's like a chicken. No, it's not. It doesn't have the same bone. Where's my chef knife? My thing, my I need that. There we go. Let's do two, right? Two. Let's do two. All right. Okay. So you know this is not like a chicken. <laughs> This is not chicken. <laughs> Beautiful. I have to use these too. I can. Let's see. Okay. Sorry, guys. Live TV. And this. It's not everything. <laughs> This is someone cook it on the grill. Oh no. Not right now, but anytime. Anytime. Okay. All right. So now I've got my my rabbit marinating here for a minute and some trick infused buttermilk. Okay, we're gonna leave this for a little bit. And now, guys, I got my mac and cheese done. And this baby is going to go now. Bear with me, guys. Hmm? And, uh, I'm going to top this with Rice Krispies and Italian herbs. And I'm moving this forward. I'll make something else. Chicken meatball soup. So in my ground chicken, I'm using cream of rice. Like in place of rice and meatballs. You know, it's got cream of rice. Oh, that sounds good. But you know what? I'll do this first. Mm -hmm. And we we'll put that right there, guys. Again. So this, guys. I'm gonna have Hi, guys. Hello, Hi. my little sweet girls. Hi. How are y'all doing? Doing great, and you? Just super duper. Well, I have some uh, questions and concerns from people, but right now we're gonna go right over here to Chef Nelly Bachi. Nelly Bachi. Yeah. There we go. Um, and that is macaroni and cheese. That is correct, mac and cheese with a uh, topping of rice krispies. And Italian herbs, 
some cayenne pepper, and that pepperoncino. All right. Well, um, and just in case some of y'all are wanting to know, I'm trying to usher in St. Patrick's Day. I even have the cup that even has the lid. Okay, but right now, it, it, what else are you starting next, uh, Nella? Well, after this, I'm going to start frying my mozzarella on some cereal, cover on cereal, and that's going to be with some delicious guava uh, sauce, and then I'm going to start working on my non-baked cheesecake. Okay. I, see, I'm not sure if you guys know it, but even background noise, like grinding things and, uh, you know, pecking on things, will kind of cut your voice out sometimes. So um, keep that in mind while you're talking. Uh, by the way, would y'all would y'all talk? Uh, y'all aren't talking very much. Uh, sketchy. <laughs> of course. Sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. What is that? I, I think I'm talking. I thought I was talking. Sketchy, what were you cutting up over there? Uh, so I had a rabbit. And in case anybody was wondering, I did wash the rabbit beforehand. Um, the rabbit is marinating is in Trix uh, infused buttermilk. Okay. Ooh. And right now I've got some ground chicken meatballs. It's going to be soup and got cream of rice in the meatball. All right. Well, we can do rabbit because it's not Easter yet. So, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what is that you're rolling up there? These are right here. They're, they're oh, chicken meatballs. Perfect. Chicken they're meatballs? Brown chicken meatballs and they have cream in, in the middle. They have what in the middle? Cream of rice cereal. Oh, cream of rice cereal. All right. Okay. Yes. Well, <laughs> somebody said, y'all, Easter is called off. <laughs> oh <my God>. hey. <laughs> Texas. <laughs> right. So, I mean, y'all can even talk to each other like, hey, Nella, how's it going? And she'll say, great, Sketchy, yeah. how about you? Right. That's true. We're doing great. Okay. Well, listen, y'all are doing a fantastic job, and it's fun to watch. So. Thank you. All right. Well, I'm going to come back in just a little bit. Does anybody want to know how much? Yes, indeed. Um, okay. You have 46 minutes and 35, 34, 33 seconds. 46 minutes and 30 seconds. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay. All right. Play nice and cook hard. All right. And I'll be back directly. All right. Bye. Thank you. Bye. All right. I'm going to, I'm just making a simple meatball soup. So I'm just adding these veggies to the soup. That sounds very delicious. And I'm adding the goat cheese to my crostino. And they will be topped with some delicious fruits, guys. And that's gonna go there for a few minutes. There we go. See that I was just thinking about talking and I was burning my meatball. <laughs> We don't want you to start burning. Guys, I'm going to start doing my right. mozzarella And this bell, let's pick it up. Put it in another plate. Okay. If you have sensitive ears, please, please, please make sure you step away from your phone. I'm using corn cereal like the regular cornflakes, the old-fashioned one. Maybe I'll like that. It's easier. And sorry about the mess, guys. And let's move this for a second. All right, put these in. Okay. 
is humming here. How is your kitchen over there? Um, uh, well, I turned my air conditioner down to six before we start, so it's me too. Up. It's starting to get warm now, though. <laughs> it's it warm. is very warm. Very warm. Okay. Okay. Very warm. And I'm now putting my mozzarella balls, guys, in the flour. Okay. Let's go ahead and pour them all in there. There we go. And then here, start this up. Nice. <laughs> Let me add a little bit of oil to this. Okay. Now, I don't know if any of you know what honey smacks are, but the mascot is a frog. Oh, Apple Jacks. So get no, the honey oh, smacks. Here's this. There you go. There's my legs. You can show the frog legs. Ta da! <laughs> Okay, so the Alexa. Alexa. Alexa, set a seven minute timer. Okay, so I'm gonna just lightly season these with a little bit of this. I don't wanna overdo this because we're gonna put honey smacks on here. These frog legs are gonna have a honey smack barbecue sauce. And probably some glazed on too. Beautiful. You can see guys right here. I'm frying the balls in some cornflakes. First one was um, just plain regular flour. And since the mozzarella is salty, I'm just gonna go ahead and wait until we are done frying them to season them. How's everybody doing today? Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, thank you for the support. I cannot see you, but thank you for being here. All right, so for one. Yeah. You see, guys, this is a two hand job and very messy. <laughs> But it is so worth it. Uh, I'll up the here. It's a dot of smoke. Not too much. That's too much. And here is the tiny little molasses. You look at that. Hold on. Oh, we are almost done, guys. Guys, 
this is guava sauce. Your new soup. is perfect for the contrast of sweet and salty. Away. There you go, guys. Just a little bit of salt, not too much, but you have too much, can do what I did. There we go. And now, I wash the spoon. Okay. On more guava. Hi, girls. Hi. Hi. Hi, girls. What's up? Are y'all feeling lucky? I hope so. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Well, what is that beautifulness you've got on that white plate there? Right here, this is fried mozzarella with uh, cornflake cereal and topped with some parsley and delicious guava sauce. Guava sauce. Uh, okay, yes. well, that looks good. Did you cook? Have you made anything else since the last time I came in? And I'm going to go ahead right now and start with my chicken to fry it. All right. And uh, what have you got sprawled out in that pan right there, Sketchy? All right, we've got some frog legs. All right. They look a little naked. Frog legs are Hold on a second. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, I want you to know if my husband knew you had frog legs, he would be right straight <laughs> over there. And rabbit. I'm just saying. All right, what else is, all right what's in that pan behind your uh, frog legs? Right here, I've got my, my meatball soup. Okay. And the meatballs, Ooh. I would have uh, the cereal. They have the rice in the meatballs. Okay, well, that looks mighty fine. Hey, girls, I would come eat with either of you, okay? Now, for a little while, y'all were narrating, and uh, and y'all kind of slacked off. I don't know if it's because there's only so much you can say about a frog or, or um, oh, the mozzarella. That looks, that cheese. I had fried cheese curds for lunch today. They were so good. All right. Well, I, I see cereal all over Sketchy's kitchen. Um, she's got <laughs> some, some, what smacks? Honey smacks. Well, there, somebody said Honey they used smacks. to call them. Honey smacks what? with a frog. Right. Yeah. And then there's also sugar smacks. And they're the same thing, but okay. different. 
Okay. But anyway. All right. Well, what's that sketch? Oh, that's your plate for the for the frogs. Woo! My frogs. She's cooking frog legs. <laughs> all right. Well, listen. Y'all are doing different things, but it's all looking so yummy. And uh, I want to. Ah, well, do y'all have any questions? So far, no. How much time? Good, good. All right. So nobody wants to know how much time they have. Yes, uh, 30 minutes. You have 33 minutes and 8 seconds. Thank you. So, uh-huh. So I'm going to pop off and, uh, you know, I could just stand here and talk and y'all could cook, but sometimes you will give us a glimpse. You'll say, oh, I got to get my frog legs cooking, and we'll know you're doing frog legs. So uh, let us yes. know. Say, say All right. Bye, girls. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I'm going to use a little bit more of this, even though this didn't really grind like I wanted it. You will have a rich mat in here in the kitchen. <laughs> and we got one left. Perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and put it as well. But I heard that is enough. Beautiful. Oh yeah. Perfectly golden. And the temperature. Because I want to slow fry it and then fry it on real high. So it can get real, real crunchy. That's what we want. Hey guys. Let me let this go right real quick. Here, switch this way, over this way. Now we're gonna turn this. Now okay. I'm getting We have butter. We have some oatmeal. This is kale that's going to go in my soup. And it's just called black kale. I thought it was called something else. And anyway, we got some sugar. And a little bit of cinnamon. There we go. And this was. I was looking for, and this is for my crumble to get together and well combined. We're almost taking some of the stuff out of the oven. Oh, this smells amazing, guys. Really good. Where are you, where are you at right now? Oh, sorry. All right, I am doing my crumble. Okay. My cobbler. Beautiful. Guys, this is the dish for my cobbler.
baking spray. Using one lemon. That is my Thank you very much. Look at those dirty and some Lost one food. <laughs> you don't worry about that. Continue moving. I'll pick it up and wash it again. Mm -hmm. You can see. This is for a cobbler, so I'm not being uh, too precise with the cuts because I want those big chunks of fruit to be found in that delicious cobbler. Again, I put some lemon. This one, this piece has some tea. Johnny cakes. Oh, you're making Johnny cakes. I love them. flour, my cornmeal, my cornflakes in place of more cornmeal. Two eggs will go in. Two eggs and no eggshell. We don't need the eggshell. I've got some butter. Baking powder. Oh, I want to go in. Let me check my little, my little size over here. Okay. 
Hello, beautiful people. Hey, um, you sure guys sure are in the zone, as Cass said. Um, so y'all are just cooking your heart away, and that looks so beautiful. I can see Sketchy's pan. I, I cannot see what's in yours, uh, Nella. Is it what is that? Oh, it's in it your is pan. fried chicken. It's fried chicken with cornflakes. Oh, okay, chicken. And here, yes, and right now I'm doing a pear cobbler, and the topping, uh, the crumble has oatmeal, cinnamon, flour, and sugar. Okay. Well, are you interested in knowing your time? Yes. yes. Okay. Aren't you have twenty two minutes and thirty one seconds? Beautiful. All right. Well, everything looks really good. Sketchy, what is that? Is that your rabbit? This is a rabbit. Okay. And what else have we got going on over? I will be making a makeup featuring tricks also. Okay. Well, are, is that, okay. I thought that green was part of the plate, and I was wanting to know where you got it, that plate. But I see that that is the... Yeah. Okay. I'm my bad. I'm I'm trying to find all things green these days. All right. So, what are you making right this moment, Sketchy? I'm making a maple aioli. Aioli. Oh, okay. that uh -huh. sounds all fancy. It have tricks in it as well. Okay. I don't, I'm not sure aioli is what that is, but you know, we're gonna find out. So y'all watch. Okay. All right. So you got garlic bread over there, Nella? No, actually, those are crostino. Crostino. Uh, those are crostinos with goat cheese, and I'm gonna top them with fresh fruit honey and granola. All right. All right. So we're doing this sweet and savory thing. I see it happening all up in here. It's just all up in here. And so y'all just, what do you open in there? Me? So yes. This is the okay, I'm just, sketchy, what was that you open? Oh, I see what it is. Are those the kids? The cereal? There, well, yeah, they are. <laughs> but the silly rabbit isn't going to have them tonight. <laughs> no, that's clear. That is clear. They are not. No, uh, we're not going to talk about rabbit right now. So anyway, you girls keep up the fantastic work. Any other words you want to say before we uh, bug out of here? I'll see y'all in a little bit and walk you right straight out of it. When I come back in next time, you need to be ready to start plating pretty quickly. Okay. No problem. Thank you. Okay. All right. You have 20 minutes. Perfect. Bye, girls. Bye. Bye. There we go. Easter bunny on the plate. <laughs> <laughs> What's your going over there, Sketchy? Close that. My dad is on the plate. Well, guys, since this has strawberries in it, I'm not going to put strawberries. I'm going to use um, delicious, fresh blackberries that I have right here uh, in a huge basket of fruits that I washed previously. And as you can see, we have delicious white strawberries as well. You can help me. I found it. Let's go ahead and put the white strawberry. Why not, right? And I'm going to start plating, guys. 
wherever I can fit that little itty bitty play that I have. Water, please. Monster. Me. And guys, I'm rippling from balsamic reduction to this. So you guys can see it. Let me stir this up. In my Johnny cake, I've got some um, strawberry flake. A Johnny cake is a pancake, but it has flour and cornmeal. So it's not exactly cornbread, but it's not exactly a pancake. It's a half and half. It's a half and half. Yeah, and so I added the strawberry cornflakes as part of my cornmeal. Uh huh. This is vanilla, guys. And over here. Our sugar. Mm -hmm. We're gonna use this one that's a little bit hotter, and this one I'll save it. You can see. I'm mixing. What else are you making, Sketchy? I've got my Johnny Cakes going. Starting. Okay. Beautiful. Hey guys, got my piping bag. And I can smell the strawberry cornflakes in here. Can you smell it? Cornflakes. <laughs> that has to be delicious. So I have never seen strawberry frosted flakes, okay? And when really? I when I had to go cereal, I so many cereals. I must be like so old um, oh. that I've seen cereals that I've never seen before. So, well, guys, I'm using right here the strawberry granola cereal. 
that you all can see. Now, for what we have here, push it down. There we go. And this is going to be a trifle, as you can see. Okay, I'm taking the strawberries from the okay, and I'm going to rehydrate them to add to my maple syrup or oh, my fun. Johnny cake. to do is And the last one. And pour it so that way we don't run out of time. <laughs> you know, the time goes faster than you think, right? Yes, yes, it does. I always think I'm going to have a lot of time and then I don't. No, actually, we don't. Like this, and 
Oh, this smell, this smell like strawberry. These are, these are so strawberry, okay? Let me grab Look at that baby. I don't know how many minutes are What? No, no, no. No, it's not. Okay, now I'm making, I'm making a classic parfait because, you know. Oh, that's delicious. With granola and dragon fruit. So when this show is over, I want everyone to know that I will be eating this and this. <laughs> that has my name on it. Oh, let's thicken and it's still going to be pulling apart. <laughs> All right, so I've got vanilla yogurt. <laughs> you know what, hand me a I don't get my hands all red. Just, sir. Oh, oh, look, they match my shirt. It's so pretty. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Now, I'm gonna so you guys can see, mm -hmm. this is chicken. And always, 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 for my signature, let's see if it wants to pop, pray, and come down. I love to do salad with some delicious, mm -hmm. delicious honey. How does that look, guys? That looks, all of that looks amazing, my friends. You're at the five-minute mark right this minute, okay? Thank you. All right, so I want to tell the people that are here that you are the one who is going to determine the winner between these two people, and uh, you can do it by going to foodtalktv.com or grubmatch.tv, either one, and you can go vote for your favorite chef. And uh, they've all been throwing down tonight and cooking beautiful stuff. I'm seeing some really pretty stuff that I would certainly eat. It looks great. Hey, that <laughs> looks great. <laughs> uh, thank it? you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. That's the sugar smack commercial. I mean, uh, no, Frosted Flake commercial. Yes, ma'am. Oh, yeah, yeah, everybody go vote. Everybody go vote. Please vote. And if you just got here and you didn't get to watch it and you want to be fair, in a couple of days you can go to uh, YouTube and go to Food Talk TV on YouTube and you can re-watch this very live, the whole thing. And maybe y'all will learn how to cook frog legs and, um, you know, that sort of stuff. And um, all right, so girls, uh, we're at about three and a half minutes. So be thinking about plating <laughs> if you haven't yes. already. And then uh, I want to ask that when we uh, call time, 
I'm going to let Chef Nella Bocci go first and show her food and explain what it is. And I'm going to ask that the uh, sketchy chef just be polite and be quiet and sing when it's sketchy's turn. Okay, let's let's do that. All right. See you in a minute. Bye. No, I'm not leaving. I'm staying. Oh, you're not. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna make me a cereal cheese fruit ball then. You get to watch Ooh, this. I want to see that. Come back a little bit because it doesn't make noise. Well, that sounds like me weed eating my yard. You guys. All right, y'all. Don't forget to go vote, okay? Don't forget. Food Talk TV. Right up in the corner, far left corner. That's how it's spelled. Foodtalktv.com. And you can vote or you can go to grubmatch.tv and vote. And uh, so this is going to be fun. And go rewatch it on um, YouTube if you'd like. Oh, we've got the fruit loops out. And how many minutes? Ooh. I like fruit loops. Sherry, how many minutes? We have one minute, 28 seconds. All right. All right, listen, at the end, after everybody shows their food, we're going to um, go off, give y'all three minutes to vote, or just hang around, come back, though, in three minutes, and then we're going to announce next week's winner, not, not winner, next week's contestant, and he may even be coming in and letting you meet him. And we're going to tell the secret ingredient. Sketchy, are you ready to hear who I picked? don't think I would. I'm not going to tell it to you. I'm going to say, do you want to hear who picked the ingredient? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Chef Bradley. Great. <laughs> That's going to be fun. All right, y'all, we had 24 seconds. Why is this not sticking up here? Help me down, Scott. I don't know what's on. Okay. Should just... yeah. All right, we're at eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Y'all hear the beeper? Hear it? All right. <laughs> we're done, guys. Hands up. Hands <laughs> up. Step away <laughs> from the place. Okay. Now. Okay. Now, let's put Sketchy's uh, camera on Sketchy. And Why now, don't you come over here? On this way. All right. So, Chef Nella, uh, yes. if you can get somebody to train in on your food and show it closer where we can have a good Perfect. look at it. And if not, I'll be more than happy to do it. Let me go ahead and turn the camera on. Oh, sorry. There we She'll go. Be back. Okay. Be back. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here. She's here. She She's just figuring out how to turn it yes. around. There we go. Okay, guys. So right here, and sorry about the mess, we have a delicious sake cinnamon toast crunch milkshake. We have the, <laughs> some mac and cheese topped with Rice Krispies and Italian herbs plus some cayenne pepper. Uh, here we have some fresh mozzarella balls deep fried in corn flakes with a guava sauce. On this side we have a crostino and they are with goat cheese. We have strawberry granola and we have them topped with blackberries and white strawberries with a balsamic reduction glaze. 
We have a nun bake cheesecake with granola, and we have strawberry, white strawberries, and also blackberries. <laughs> we have honey, uh, well, this is crusted cornflakes chicken, and is topped with honey and spices, cayenne pepper, paprika, kind of with a delicious cake. I made a homemade gelato, and I put it on my uh, cobbler, as you can see it there. And this is a pear cobbler with strawberries, and it has oatmeal in it. And that's it, guys. Okay. Wow. Uh, wow. <laughs> very beautiful. beautiful. Now y'all seen Thank you. Chef Mellis, and now we're going to turn it over to Miss Sketchy and let her explain her food. Perfect. I have a chicken meatball soup. In the soup, I have cream of rice cereal. I've got Ooh. some <laughs> Johnny cakes here, which are half flour and half cornmeal. And I added the strawberry cornflakes in for some of the cornmeal. Okay? And boy, these things, they taste like strawberry. Let me tell you, these are strawberry. All right. And then, oh, and then I reconstituted some special taste strawberry. And I put that in my maple syrup for my Johnny cakes. Then I've got a perfect Ooh. granola. So it's granola, granola, granola with, um, what are these things called? Dragon fruit. Dragon fruit. Then I've got some cinnamon rolls. They're chocolate peanut butter cinnamon rolls with Reese's Puffs. Okay. Ooh, yeah, did Reese's I say that right? Puffs. So inside yep. there's chocolate chips and, you know, brown sugar cinnamon. And then I've got the Reese's Puffs inside and also on the top. All right. Now, here I made a... Honey Smacks barbecue sauce. Let me taste my barbecue sauce. <laughs> Ooh, very good. To go with my frog legs because I don't know if you all know Honey Smacks. Honey Smacks has a frog. Okay. So, <laughs> so I took frog legs for that. And then I think my, okay, I've got my little, my little, this is a sweet cream cheese cereal ball okay and so you can dip anything in it cookies or whatever i've got graham crackers along with it and then we have our the rabbit tricks are for kids so these were <laughs> sitting in the tricks infused buttermilk and then I, i've got a maple aioli featuring trick oh awesome Ta everything sounds <laughs> delicious Okay. It all looks delicious, delicious, <laughs> delicious, girls. And I appreciate y'all. And I know all these, all these people that are in here appreciate you. And I want you all to go to foodtalktv.com, spelled just like in the upper left corner, or grubmatch.tv and vote for whichever one you think won. If you're not sure, wait a couple of days and go watch it the rerun on Food Talk TV on YouTube, and you can watch the whole thing. So I want you to come back in three minutes and meet next week's contestant and find out the secret ingredient that Chef Bradley has picked out for Sketchy to torment her because he loves her so much. <laughs> okay. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Nella. Thank you, Thank you for coming. Oh, no, and thank you for competing. Thank you, Sketchy, oh, no, for please. the show. And... See y'all later. All right, bye. Thank guys. you guys. A great opportunity. Love y'all. Bye. All right. Bye.